$750,000. That's what it takes to buy a starter home right now in Vancouver. It's a lot of money for not a lot of hosts. So tonight, CTV Scott Roberts is taking a look at what all that money can buy for those willing to put up with a commute. Well, you're not going to miss this home on the block, that's for sure. We showed you yesterday what $750,000 will get you in Vancouver. Close to the Evergreen Line. Now we'll look at what that would buy you in a city like Coquitlam. We found this home listed on Riverview Crescent. On the outside, quite a difference, and that continues inside. As you can see, this is a lot different than the house we saw yesterday inside. Substantially different. This home more than double the size of that Vancouver property and move-in ready. Side by side, you can see the updated finishes when compared in the living room. You've got beautiful white oak floors throughout. In the bedroom, size is the big difference, and in the kitchen, quite a contrast. A lot of updating needed in the older Vancouver home, almost nothing to do in the Coquitlam property. It's tastefully done. Modern lighting. I wouldn't do anything here. There's also a backyard here, a huge rec room, and a large covered patio facing green space. And it's private. You've got trees. You've got a nice hedge, no windows looking out to you. Let's compare the two homes by the numbers. The Vancouver property, two bedrooms, one and a half bathrooms, 1,300 square feet. The selling price, $757,000. The Coquitlam home, four bedrooms, three full baths, almost 2,800 square feet, more than double the size. The asking price, $730,000. I moved from Vancouver out to Coquitlam because I wanted a bigger home. And realtors say they are seeing more young families moving east as prices skyrocket in the city. If you're willing to deal with a longer commute, you could get a lot more home. It's lot size, mostly in house size. You get more bang for your buck out here. But of course, it all comes down to lifestyle and location. And it might be hard for some to give up being so close to all this. Scott Roberts, CTV News, Vancouver.